Sergio, where are we? We're at Leak Edge Camping and Caravan Park. We're on the edge of Leak in Staffordshire. On the side of the motorway, it sounds like. We're not. It's just a little bit busy at this time of day. I think it's rush hour. It's quarter past five. But we're here. We've ordered the food. We're in a restaurant and Louis already embarrassed us by sticking his nose at the skirt of the waitress and then licking her feet. So, but he's a good boy. So what's the plan he's tomorrow? Out. Um, get up, shower, hair wash, leisurely stroll into leak and to my friend's wedding blessing. Which is tree uggers and vegans, isn't it? Yes. And dancing around naked around the maple no, or something. No, none of that. And then um, party, and then after that, night in the campsite again, and then we'll see where we go from there the next day. To Wheels, and we boil. Wheels boil. Yum yum. Yum, 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 yum. significant announcement. These chips are the best chips as well. Better than cotton monster. Astounding. What a revelation. The beat in it. So nice. Well I don't really know what there is to say about the market town of Leek. Apart from there's some good pubs, they have some strange names for the takeaway and for their pubs. Just a traditional sort of market town. Had a lovely meal last night, lovely meal for lunch today. Some lovely cider that was prepared in oak casts that had been used for whiskey. 7% proof. It's the type of thing I need before I go to a wedding or a blessing type thing with a group of vegans. Yesterday at the hippie wedding, Laura and Stephen, congratulations. We're doubling up on the Ridge Monkeys today. Joe's having a cheese sandwich, toasted, and I'm on Linda McCartney's best. Look at them! And we'll uh, see if we'll encourage Louis to have one. So um. Plan for today. Is we get packed up, breakfast get packed up, and then we're going to head down to Wales, and we're hopefully going to see if we can get somewhere near the inland surfing place tonight, 
to go surfing there tomorrow and then continue to head south down to Pembrokeshire area. We've got the bikes, the kayaks, the surfboards and all the fishing gear and everything with us and a rather tired whippet who's parted out. So where are we at, Joe? We're in the Guerrasil. <laughs> where? Again. <laughs> Guer... Guer... We are in the Guerrasil campsite. It's easy for you to say. <laughs> in Conwy, Conwy, in Wales, and it's lovely. And how far are we from the surf centre? Um, it's not far, but I think it's about a fifteen-minute drive, something like that. And we booked in for. 11 o'clock. Where people can laugh at me drowning myself yep. again. Yeah. Have you recovered from your party in the reef? He's tired, aren't you? I'm tired. I'm hot. One thing we've come across on this campsite we've just pitched up at is this lovely mini caravan. There's a couple here who don't live far away and they've had this for a couple of years. But it's amazing what you can actually get into this. The guy who's with this is six foot two, and uh, he obviously fits in it. And they take it all over the place on the back of their car. They're planning to do the NC 500 next year. It's built by West Midland Trailers, um, and they're around five thousand pound, depending on the specification. And these have put an awning on the side and uh, got an additional roof rack on it. It's got its own solar panel. It's got a gas ring burner and a sink um, and it's really well set up look at the inside of that amazing for such a small caravan it's obviously not going to take much room in the driveway to store it <laughs> what are you doing practice in for tomorrow Does that look apart <laughs> you look like summer <laughs> Is that how it's done, is it? See, not half of it. Simple as that. What's the worst that can happen? <laughs> <laughs>